Hey guys, this is Gabriel from the Coffee Field, and uh, today I wanted to make a video and show you a quick trick that I do um, if I wake up late in the morning and I don't have time to do a manual pour uh, for my V60. So I have the Be More Brazen Plus here, and what I what I realized is um, if you have a number two V60 drip or anything smaller and number three glass carafe or anything smaller you can actually fit them in the Beemore Brazen Plus and then the Beemore can do the work for you so let me show you how okay so basically you need to take out the filter holder you take out the stainless steel carafe and you put in your glass carafe and your V60 and as you can see it fits perfectly um, now what I'm going to do is I already have have water here so I'm just going to put in the filter the V60 filter okay I already have coffee ready to go so I'm going to put in I'm just going to do 150 grams I usually use 10 or 11 grams for 150 grams out and then I'm going to put it in just like this okay and then I'm going to hit start and then if you have something else to do you can just you know go to the restroom in the morning or do whatever you want to do and uh, the beam more is going to heat up the you know water to whatever your set temperature here and then it's just going to start with brewing okay so like I said, it's pretty much done, so you just take it out. And I'm going to get a mug. So I guess I took it out just a few seconds early, but that beeping means that it was done. So just take, take this out. I'm going to put it here for now, and then I'm going to pour it in. how the be more did just to see how delicious it is or how bad it is I don't know it is actually really nice um, it tastes pretty good Especially considering that I didn't have to stand here and um, manually uh, pour in. Um, so now I'm going to pause and then I'm going to come back. I'm going to grind more coffee and then I'm going to do another 150 grams of coffee. And this time I'm going to do it with the kettle. I have 150, I have actually 250 grams here. I'm going to heat them up and the reason I have 250 grams is because I like to use 100 grams to heat up the glass carafe before I actually start brewing the coffee. And uh, yeah, I'm going to make another V60 cup. This time I'm going to do it with this you know, kettle here. Just to see how it tastes like compared to the V60 brewed by the Be More Brazen Plus. Okay, so now I have my Bonavita kettle pretty much set at 201. Temperature is already at 201, so we're ready to go. Uh, so, like I said, what I'm going to do, I'm going to pour in 100, 100 grams first just to wet the filter and um, heat up the, the glass carafe. And then I have coffee here ready and we're going to make a cup. I just emptied the 100 grams worth of water and uh, I have the coffee here so we're going to do that 150 grams of uh, 20 grams and we're going to do that I'm sorry it's 10 10 and a half uh, which is 150 grams I usually do 21 grams for three, 21 grams of coffee for 300 
grams of liquid. So here I have 10 grams and change. So I have the water set at 201 and then I'm going to start my time. And I'm also going to do 45 seconds of free soak just so we can match the Be More Brazen Plus. And I actually do 45 seconds of pre-soak anyway. Gonna use the hold feature here so we can keep this at 201. And then we're gonna wait for this. We have 20 more seconds. It's showing 25 seconds here. 10 more seconds. Now this is heating back to 201. And five seconds. Okay, perfect timing. This just reached 201, and here it's 45 seconds. Now I'm going to do this. Okay, so that's 160 grams, so a little bit more. And we're just going to wait for it to drip. And then once this is done, I'm going to pour it in and I'm going to taste it so I can tell you what I think. Um, if I can tell, So I can tell you if it's close to the B more, if it's better or if it's worse. Okay, so it's pretty much done. Again, I'm going to put this here for now. Get another cup. Pour in our 150 grams. taste it. Okay, so for some reason this is a little less bitter. Uh, so I would say it's a little better than what, what the it's a little better than the cup that came from the Be More, but it's not that much, that much better. Um, probably if you didn't have the cups like back to back, you wouldn't realize the difference. Um, and I would say that both of them taste really good. Um, like I said, the only difference is I think the the one that I did manually was a little less bitter for some reason. Um, but that's it really. And I think that the only that the only reason I was able to notice that is because I did the cups back to back. So I just tasted one and then I'm tasting another one. But if you just woke up in the morning and you're making a cup, um, I, I don't think you're going to notice that this is less bitter than, um, than the Be More. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope I give you an idea. Um, if you have this you know, machine or if you have something similar, that you can use the uh, shower screen here to uh, brew other type of, uh, of uh, uh, to brew coffee using other coffee methods, other brewing methods such as the V60 or even you know Chemex. If you have a smaller Chemex that can that can fit here, um, that would also be a good idea. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please, if you have any feedback or any you know comments, if you can leave them down below. I hope you guys liked this video. If you found it helpful, I would I would appreciate it if you give it a like, and if you subscribe to my channel, I'm uh, trying to make uh, more videos of um, of coffee equipments and uh, and uh, coffee stuff. So uh, stay tuned.